right, people, what up? It's your boy, 1904 Comics. This week, I only got one comic book. I was going to get Wrath, but my comic book store didn't have it, so I ended up getting Velvet. Boom. You know, number two, it was good. It started off pretty slow. I had to wait till like the last three pages to get to some action. Hopefully this one starts off right away. It'll make me wait. Because I hate waiting. I have ADD. <laughs> Anyways, because I only got one comic, I got some older issues of Batman. Now, when I first started reading comics and collecting in general, I started off with Batman, Spider-Man, X-Men, stuff like that. You know, when I was a kid, because I felt comfortable with it. And as, you know, I continued to get into the comics, I got newer stuff. So I put the older stuff on the back burner. I took a batch of this week and I got some older stuff. Here is Batman 512. Here is Batman number 518. And here's Batman 519. Boom. And Batman 491. I believe I may have this one. But it's a badass cover, so I don't mind having doubles. And that's all I got for this week. I checked what's coming out next week. It's quite a bit I'm going to get. So, that's cool. Anyways, let's get into some reviews now. Here is Ninja Turtles number 27. And number 28. Now those ones, they were cool. I felt number 29 was better. I feel the artwork in number 29 was better as well. I don't know. I could be tripping, but that's my opinion. Anyways, if you're out there and you're thinking about getting Ninja Turtles, but you're not sure, just pick it up because it's really good. It proved me wrong. Like I said before in one of my videos, I thought I was going to be like Kawabanga and Kitty-ish. But it's really good. So, yeah, that's why I went and got a couple more. And if you're thinking about it, just pick it up. Try it out. You know, it's not going to hurt you. But I'm pretty sure you'll like it. So get it. Here is Batman Superman number 7. And once again, the artwork's always great. Story's freaking good. In this issue, Batman gets pissed off because Superman allows himself to die in the game. And once that happens, they can team up once again and they start whooping ass. Here is Manifest Destiny number 3. Boom. Uh, in the second issue, it leaves off of those people in the church, I believe it was. Those plant people. And in this issue you find out, you know, in order to kill the plant people, you gotta burn them. And in general, just, it's good. And I feel the first issue is the best issue. And the second issue would be second, and this would be third. I mean, it's not a bad issue. It's still a good comic. I liked it, but that's just my opinion. Here is Sheltered. Once again, I never see this on anyone's videos. I may be the only person to read it. I don't care. I like it. It's about, you know, a prepper community. Like I said before, one of the kids kind of brainwashes all the other ones. Says, hey, we got to kill our parents because they're going to hold us back. But before he kills the parents, one, one of the guys, the main person of the, you know, the little community, he orders some solar panels. And the guy's like, hey, okay, cool. I'll send them. We'll have them delivered to your door in two weeks. Well, those two weeks are up. And that's where this kind of, you know, takes off. The dudes show up. The kids go crazy. Kill one of them. The other dude, you know, he's trying to fight for his life. He's running. So, yeah, it's a pretty good comic. If you haven't read it, read it. Here is Black Widow number one. Now, I'm going to say, at first I was kind of skeptical. I didn't know what to think. But I liked it. Um, a lot of action in it, that's for sure. Uh... Just a little snippet of her backstory, to be honest. It kind of gives you what she does with her money, I should say. She uses it for, in case she dies, she has, you know, money left over for certain people and certain things and whatnot. So that's cool. There's a lot of action in it, though. I can't wait for number two. And, yeah, don't be so skeptical about this. Get it. It's pretty good. Forever Evil Arkham War. It was all right. Bane gets that talent dude, tells him, hey, your people are kidnapped. Go whoop ass. He does. I don't know. A lot of people are in love with the Forever Evil. And it's alright to me. Scooby-Doo team up. So far, so good. I like it. And for three bucks, I get some good laughs. Can't complain about that. 
And sometimes I feel like Batman 66, I mean, it's funny, but I don't know. For some reason, I feel like maybe, boom, this is a little funnier. And last but not least is Walking Dead 119. This fool right here, I forget his name. I think it's Ezekiel or whatever. Anyways, this dude pushes out. Negan rolls up, ready to whoop ass. He's inside the house crying about how he lost Shiva. And, you know, people died because of him. Like, suck it up, bro. Go out there. You guys are about to get killed. Cry about it later. And Negan has a little Walker surprise for him. So that was pretty fun. But, uh, that's all I got for you guys this week. Hopefully I see your videos pretty soon. Because, uh, you know, I'll be watching them. Seeing what you guys are picking up. See what you guys think about certain comics. Let me know what you think about my stuff. Drop a comment. Because, you know, that's how it should be. Let me know what you think. I'll let you know what I think because that's what I do. Like, subscribe, share. And once again, leave a comment. And uh, I'm pretty excited because I heard some news about Comic Con, which is here in San Diego. This is where it all started. Last year at Comic Con, I was going to buy comics. I was walking to get some and I hear over the loudspeakers, everyone get the hell out because we're going to close down. So I was bummed. But the following week or two, I went to my comic book store where I go now. I got some stuff. And that's how the whole comic thing sparked up. So I'm excited for this year's Comic Con because I am going to buy some damn comics. Anyways, people, uh, see you laters. Get those videos out there so I can drop some comments. Peace out, people. Laters.